exercise on a question number one so when you look at we can see that highest power is three denominator highest power is two on numerator so this fraction is a proper fraction so there is two uh, there is a repeated root so we start right a over x b over x square plus c over x plus one now 3x square plus x plus 1 over x square times x plus 1 equal so common denominator is x square times x plus 1 then this is going to be a times um, there's 1x so 1x is missing x times x plus 1 times b times uh, x plus 1 and c times uh, x square so this is cancelled out as a result uh, 3x square plus x plus 1 equal a um, x times x plus 1 plus b x plus 1 and c x square so I'm going to try to work out with the equating coefficient technique um, I will expand this one first of all a x square plus 1 plus b x plus 1 and c x square and 3 x square plus x plus 1 and then I can see a plus b plus c x square when we expand there's no b actually a plus c a x square and uh, after that we make x square c x square so a plus c x square then uh, middle x there is no x there is one x so b x and then the constants so this is a and this is b a plus b now 3 x square plus x plus 1 so then we equating the coefficient of x square we will get uh, 3 equal a plus c and equating the coefficient of x we will get 1 equal b so b is straight away we could manage to take then x naught or the constant so this is going to be uh, again 1 equal a plus b now we have three equation we have to solve uh, from here from we know that uh, b value is 1 then uh, 1 equal a plus 1 this will bring a equal 0 then from here when a equal 0 say one from one when a equals zero c is you can see three now this is going to be vanish and finally the answer is going to be um three x square plus x plus one or x square times x plus one equal a is zero it's vanish so then b we know we found out b equal 1 1 over x square plus c is 3 over x plus 1 question number 2 so we can see that this is a proper fraction so and repeated root so a over x plus 1 plus b over x plus 1 square plus uh, c over x minus 1 now minus x square minus x is minus 5 x plus 1 square x minus 1 equal so this is going to be the common factor and uh, how many x plus 1s goes to this one x plus 1 square minus x minus 1 so 
to find this one we have to divide the common factor from here so this is cancel out remain is x plus 1 times x minus 1 and this one we will multiply with this a times x plus 1 x minus 1 same as b times how many x plus 1 square goes to this one x minus 1 how many uh, x minus uh, goes to x plus 1 square x minus 1 that is x plus 1 c times x plus 1 square so this is minus x square minus x, x minus 5 and uh, a times this is cancel out uh, x plus 1 x minus 1 b x minus 1 c x plus 1 square let's take uh, x equal 1 so this is going to be cancel out minus 1 square 10 1 minus 5 equal a times this is 0 plus b times 0 plus uh, c 1 plus 1 square so 2 square so this is going to be uh, 4c equal this is minus 15 minus 16 so c equal minus 4 let x equal minus 1 then minus 1 square 10 minus 1 minus 5 equal uh, a times 0 plus b minus 1 minus 1 plus c times this is 0 then um, this is going to be minus 2b and this is uh, minus 1 plus 10 minus 5 so this will make uh, 5 4 so b equal minus 2 or divide by 2 now let uh, x equal 0 we'll put 0 to everywhere then uh, this is minus 5 and this is uh, uh, a 0 plus 1 0 minus 1 plus b 0 minus 1 and plus c 0 plus 1 square that is minus 5 equal uh, minus a minus b and plus c now we need to find we know c we know b we want to find a a equal 5 minus b minus c 5 minus b is minus 2 and c is minus 4 so this is going to be 5 plus 2 plus 4 so this is going to be sorry this is minus b plus c so this is plus so this is minus 4 So we can write the partial fraction as minus x square minus 10x minus 5 over x plus 1 square x minus y equal a is uh, my, um, 3 3 over x plus 1 then minus 2 over x plus 1 square then plus minus C value is 4, uh, x minus 1. Question number 3. Um, everything is same. Uh, 2x square plus 2x minus 18 over x times x minus 3 square equal. Um, this is the same thing uh, if you multiply cross. Um, p over x plus uh, q over x minus 3 uh, plus r over x minus 3 square times if you cross multiply by this one 
x times x minus 3 square then what is the remainders here so this is going to be p times uh, okay i will write one more term x times x minus 3 square over p over x plus x times x minus 3 square times q over x minus 3 times x times uh, x minus 3 square this is this a waste of time but just for your information this is cancel out so x minus 3 square p then this is x minus 3 1 cancel out q times x uh, x minus 3 and then this is uh, cancel out this is xr so 2x square plus 2x minus 18 is this one Yeah, we will stay with this one and we'll work now. Let uh, x equal 3. Let uh, x equal 3. We can see 2, 3 square times 2, 3 uh, minus 18 equal. This is p0 plus q0 plus 3r. So this value is going to be 6 equal 3r. So r equal 2. Then we'll introduce uh, let x equal 0. This is 0, 0 minus 18 equal. So p times 0 minus 3 square plus. This is 0 and this is 0. And then this is 9 p equal minus 18. p equal minus 2. Now I will substitute let uh, x equal 1. This is 2 1 square plus 2 1 minus 18 equal p 1 minus 3 square plus q 1 1 minus 3 plus 1 r. So this is 2 plus 2 minus 18 equal 1 minus 3 minus 2 square 4 p. Uh, this is going to be 1 minus 2q plus r. So this is uh, 4 minus 18 that is 14 equal. I need to find uh, q. So we, I know r value. 4 times 2 minus 2q plus r is... Uh, uh, Actually, P is minus 2 and R is 2. Minus 14 equal minus 8 minus 2Q plus 2. So, this will give 2Q equal, I'll bring to this side, 14 minus 8 plus 2. So, 2Q equal 8Q equal 4. So now, we can write P minus 2 over X plus Q is uh, 4 over x minus 3 minus r plus 2 over x minus 3 square.
So this is uh, y x square minus 2x minus 1 x square factorized so this is going to be x minus 1 so it is repeated rows now we can write c over x plus d over x square plus e over x minus 1 now we can write this one uh, 5 x square minus 2 x minus 1 over x square x minus 1 equal uh, x square times x minus 1 this is going to be um, c times x x minus 1 and d times x minus 1 and e times x square so this is equal pi x square minus 2x minus 1 c times x x minus 1 plus d x minus 1 plus e x square let x equal 0 so then this is minus 1 uh, this is 0 0 minus 1 equal this is 0 c times 0 and this is going to be d times minus 1 plus e times 0 so minus 1 equal minus d d equal 1 then let x equal 1 when x equal 1 this is 5 1 square minus 2 1 minus 1 this is uh, c times 1 0 d times 0 and e times 1 square so this is going to be 5 2 minus 1 equal e so this is going to be 2 e equal 2 and uh, then let uh, what shall we do now let's uh, uh, take the x square coefficient so x square coefficient is here 5 and here we will make x square this is c times uh, c x square then uh, this is going to be e x square so phi x square this is c plus e x square so then this is going to be phi u equal c plus e now we found e equal to phi equal c plus 2 c equal 3 then we can write the answer c is 3 3 over x plus d is 1 over x square plus e is 2 over x minus 1 2 x over x plus 2 square So partial fraction is given a over x plus 2 and b over x plus 2 square then 2x over x plus 2 square equal uh, a times x plus 2 plus b over x plus 2 square so this is cancel out so 2x equal a times x plus 2 plus b now we can take that uh, let x equal minus 2 then 2 minus 2 plus a minus 2 plus 2 plus b so this is going to be 0 and minus 4 equal b very simple and let uh, x equal 0 then this is 0 equal a plus 0 plus 2 plus b so 0 equal 2a plus b so 2a equal minus b which is 2a equal minus minus 4 this is 4 so a equal 2 so then we can write this one 2 over x plus 2 plus b is uh, 
minus 4 over x plus 2 square. Question number 6. Uh, a over 2x plus uh, 1. B over x minus 3. And C over x minus 3 square. So well, this is going to be 10 x square minus 10 x plus 17 equal a times uh, x minus 3 square plus b times uh, 2 x plus 1 x minus 3 and c times 2 x plus 1. Now And now let's uh, x equal 0. So this is 0, 0 plus 17 equal. This is minus a times minus 3 square plus b1 uh, times minus 3 plus c1. So this is 17 equal 9a minus 3b plus c. Uh, we'll comp take the x square coefficient that is one easy thing. So this is going to be 10 and this will make a and this will make 2b and that's all. Now c equals 11 so then 17 minus 11 is going to be uh, 11, sorry, uh, 6. 6 equal 9a minus 3b. Now we have to solve this one and find uh, a and b. So We'll multiply 1 divide by 9. My plan is to take eliminate 9. So this is 90, uh, 9, 9a plus 18b. So this is 3. Then uh, 2 minus 3 um, or 3 minus 2. Then this is become 90 minus 6, 84. 9a cancel out, 18 minus minus 3b, that is going to be 21b. So b equal 81 divided by 21, that is going to be 4. So b equal 4, now we can find from 1, from 1, a equal 10 minus 2b. So a equal 10 minus 8. So a equal 2. So we'll write now 2 over 2 x plus 1 and b is uh, 4 over x minus 3 and c is 11 over x minus 3 square. 39 square plus 2 x plus 59. This is question 7. So a times the one x plus one x y one square b um, x plus five times uh, three x minus one and c times uh, x plus five. Now let x equal 1 
So you can see it's three x minus ten. First of all, let's find that x equals zero. So this is fifty-nine equal. This is a minus one square. B are C minus one plus C times uh, I. So fifty-nine equal uh, A minus I B plus I C. Let x equal one. Then this is thirty-nine plus two fifty-nine. So this is three times three minus one two square four A plus. This is one six, and this is two. Uh, six times two twelve B plus six C. This addition is hundred. This is four A plus twelve B plus six C. I can divide by two. Fifty equal to A plus six B plus three C. Now let's consider. X equal minus five, so thirty nine minus five square, two minus five plus fifty nine equal a three times a minus five minus one square, and this is b times zero and c times zero. So this is thousand twenty four equal. Two hundred fifty-six a. This will give a equal four. And when a equal four, we can substitute to one and two equation. So this is going to be a equal four. Then fifty-nine minus four fifty-five. So fifty-five equal minus five b plus five c. And this will simplify to eleven equal minus b c, and from here uh, a equal four. This is eight. Eight when go to left side forty two. Forty two equal six uh, b plus three c. So I can divide by three. So this is c equal two b plus this is one. Twelve, four. That is fourteen. Now we have two equation. This is three and four. So when multiply three multiply by two, twenty two equal minus two b plus two c. That is five. Then four plus five. So this is going to be thirty six equal four three c. So c equal twelve. From three, um, b equal c minus twelve. C minus eleven, which is twelve minus eleven, which is one. So a equal. Now we found out four o x plus five. B is uh, One over three x minus one, and c is twelve over three x minus one square. Question number eight a. This is four x plus one. Now we can see this is x plus y over square. Then a over x plus y and b over x plus y square. Then we can write four x plus one equal a times x plus five plus b. Now x equal minus five. This is four minus five plus one equal uh, zero plus b. So this is minus twenty plus one, nineteen. So b equal minus nineteen. And let x equal zero. So one equal this is five a plus b. So five a equal one minus b one minus minus nineteen that is twenty. So a equal four. Now that is 
or this is equal 4 over x plus 5 and minus 19 over x plus 5 square this is 6 x square minus x plus 2 we can factorize uh, uh, x then this is 4 x square minus 4 x plus 1 so this is going to be 6 x square minus x plus 2 equal x times 2 x minus 1 square so this is uh, a over x b over uh, 2x minus 1 and c over 2x minus 1 square so this is going to be 6x square minus x plus 2 equal a times uh, uh, 2x minus 1 square plus b times x times 2x minus 1 plus c x now let x equal 0 this is 0 2 equal this is minus 1 square e this is going to be um, 0 and this is 0 so e equal to straight and let x equal 1 so this is 1 6 minus 1 plus 2 equal this is a times 2 minus uh, 2 minus 1 1 1 square is 1 so this is 1 this is going to be 2 minus 1 is 1 times 1 1 and c now we need 1 so this is going to be 6 minus 1 5 plus 2 7 uh, 7 equal a plus uh, b plus c and uh, yeah this is uh, let put x equal half it's difficult but we'll work with it uh, 6 uh, 1 square minus fraction i don't like but you may sometime so this is going to be 0 and this is 0 and this is c half so this is going to be 3 over 2 6 1 6 over 4 minus half plus 2 equal half a c so this is 1.5 minus 0.5 so 1 plus so this is 3 equal half a c c equal 6 now i can substitute uh, a and c here to find b so b equal from 1 b equals 7 minus a minus c so b equals 7 minus a is we found out 2 and c is 6 so b equal minus 1 then we can write uh, a we found out that is 2 2 over x plus uh, minus 1 no uh, 2x minus 1 c is 6 plus 6 over uh, 2x minus 1 square 